CQ, CQ, this is W9GFO. Is anybody out there? None of the people need to see what I've seen. They need to see... This is the way it's been done for billions of years. The small moves are... Let's take a walk. This is TEI. It has been called the Emerald Isle. Now it looks as though it's being called the Enchanted Isle. They completely reworked Spawn and I haven't even begun. I haven't even begun to know what it's all about. See? Enchanted Isle. Now this up here, oh gosh, trust the centurion told me who did this, Mr. Leprechaun something. That, my dears, is a parkour map. No kidding. Holy guacamole. And now we have, oh, I don't want to fall off. Look at this down here. That's got to be Nero's work, right? That's got to be the day-night thing. It has to be Neuropsych. Um, Neuropsych 1 and River Girl with a bunch of numbers after it. Oh dear. They have a survival world now. People who were um, premium VIP members, basically who pay a little subscription to be on the server, uh, got the perk of being able to go into survival when it first, first, first started. I'm drinking a Coke. If you can hear noise in the background, I'm very sorry, but it's hot and my fan is on. It's not too hot, so hot that I have to have the air conditioner on, but it is hot. That really looks like, well, it could be Neuro's work or, you know, it just looks like the kind of, it, it's his style. Ballistic bows, which I've never played. Mini game, what is that? Something in that tree. Uh, survival games, creative, people flying around in front of me. So now, we're not going to do any of that. I'm just going to show off the spawn. What does it say? This says, win VIP parkour. Make sure to record and post for your prize. Yeah, I'm going to do that. Mm-hmm. And not so much. Nice castle. I ha you know, they went to um Trust the Centurion and his partner and River and Nero went to Disneyland. I thought there was something suspicious about it because they didn't take any kids. So, so they took pictures, but none of the pictures had kids. And I don't think any of them were actually in the amusement park. I think they were mostly like in um like the hotel so I thought something fishy was going on uh, uh, uh. see that's a end portal thing but I don't think it really works look I think well you can't see an end portal from the bottom you know this is obviously gonna be something but I don't know why see these item frames something's gonna go here like maybe map picture things maybe Anyway, if you go this way, this is the direction it goes the way we just were, okay? But, nobody goes this way. And this is where I found all the cool stuff. Now, I'm sure, no, I don't mean that the games and stuff aren't cool, believe me. You remember Neuro's Roller Coaster, right? There's going to be more of them, by the way. They've already set it up. I can see there's tunnels leading that, that are going to lead to other portals that will take you to other... Look at this. They will take you to other roller coasters once they get them built. I don't know if mini games includes Hunger Games. I hope they still have their Hunger Games because, like, Pompeii was one of my favorites, and that Old West one I don't know the name of. And they had what was the other one I really liked? Uh, oh, the one that's Mexico City, the Canals of Mexico City. I have no idea what they called it. Okay, if I step on this plate, watch what happens. Well. Don't, which way do I want to go? Okay. It's a 
jumpy uppy. Whee! Whoops. Well, that didn't work too well. Uh, but I'm in a tree. So, the reason we're here... I have to be careful, because one time... Don't do it again. One time, I got caught in some leaves, and you can't break these leaves. So, I had to just log out and log back in. Because I was totally stuck. The reason we're really here... Look at this, the way this is done. Isn't that nice? This is interesting work, isn't it? The way the lights are, and... That's really interesting. It's a nice effect. Look at the way the hill looks. Isn't that cool? Hmm. So the reason we're here is this is a good place for me to talk. Because you don't want to see me bumping around in an old creative world with the same old golems and zombies, right? That's pretty old. Plus, it's not, it's not a world I've fleshed out or done anything with. One thing I really like about this server is that um, people are respectful to each other. There's no um, bullying or cussing people out or any of that kind of stuff, you know? So, uh, look at this. I shouldn't go this way. I should go the way I want to go. I'll show you the stuff I saw last night when I was wandering around in here. Magic torches. I don't know how they do that. I need to ask them because they did that on the other server, too. Isn't that cool? And all kinds of magic floaty things. Do I want to go on top of that hill? Probably. Can I? Wow! I went right over it! Oh, gosh. I don't want to get trapped in the leaves and because... Yeah, that was bad. <laughs> I got trapped in the leaves. So I just thought this would be a nice place to wee walk and talk. Because there's nice stuff to look at, you know? So here's what's going on. I have had um, a rough month. Um, Fatty got hurt again. And she's recovering. Fatty's recovering, but it was hard on her. Weasel got lost for three or was it four days? I've got him back, but... That was really stressful because I was walking all over town, you know, putting up flyers and asking about him and um, checking out the neighborhood to see if he was around and going over to the flea market and asking if anybody would seen him because he likes to go to the flea market. We're only two blocks from the flea market. So he's like, he likes to go there and be a bum. Pretty much everybody knows him and we it's not a big deal. Oh, look at this. I didn't see this last night. Well, I haven't seen the whole thing. I just barely started. This is so cute. So, and then... People who I... I really wanted to try to... Uh, talk things through, and they didn't want to, and... That hurts, but... It also hurts that I spent a lot of time and work! Ooh. Um on their servers and stuff and didn't get to record much and it was pretty much a waste because I, I'm not like banned from the servers or anything but I don't want to go back there <laughs> you know so all that hard work is just wasted but on also whoop, hello what kind of effect do I have speed okay so I can like speed whoa I can work my mouth. Also, I'm, uh, you know, finding out that I absolutely for sure have multiple sclerosis and that it was never diagnosed properly for 30 years. And thinking about, my gosh, my quality of life could, wow. <gasps> Hunger Games! I wonder if there's, there was no, I don't think they're ready yet. Whoa. Uh-uh. Let's see, nobody's in here, and you know how much people love Hunger Games. Well, I don't know, man. Let me see. Uh, oh. Yay, Hunger Games. Look at that beautiful emerald up there. Okay, how do you get back to... What's that? That's to get to the hub. And we're back. 
I wish you could just go back, you know? Whoops, went the wrong way. I'm in somebody's head. So there was a lot of stuff going on, you know? I had to get used to the concept of, um, I had to do a lot of research about multiple sclerosis and find out how I can take care of myself without any kind of medication and stuff because I don't think that's going to be available to me. I really don't. I don't think my insurance is going to cover it. I think they're just going to decide you're a poor old person and we don't want to pay for your health and just go away. So I've already done some things that I can do like keep down inflammation because it's the inflammation that causes damage with multiple sclerosis. It applies pressure to the insulation around the nerves, nerve endings, around the, excuse me, the nerve cells. It has insulation on it kind of like wires do. And um, the inflammation is that's swelling because of fluids in the body um, applies pressure to the insulation, which is called myelin. And it scars it. It makes little tears and stuff. And the scars are the sclera, as in sclerosis. Get it? So multiple sclerosis means many scars. And you never know where they're going to hit, if they're going to be in the brain or if they're going to be in the spinal column. And if they're going to, I wish there was boats. And if they're going to um, affect your vision or how you speak, or uh, if you're going to have funny sensations, like I was getting these weird tingly things in my um, in my outer ears, like my ears were going to sleep. And I was pretty worried because I thought, oh my gosh, my circulation is getting cut off close to my head. Well, it's a nerve damage. It's my nerves are tingling. There's no there's no problem with the blood. It's just the nerves are tingling. Isn't that cool? So, and then it goes away, and something else will happen, like a uh, numb place on my thigh, and it, it's weird. So, I'm looking for ways that I can, like, reduce the inflammation, um, keep the, keep from the inside of my body from swelling up from having too many fluids in it, and one really good cheap way to do that is aspirin. And another really good cheap way to do that and to add a mineral called potassium, which is very good for my heart and also is anti-inflammatory, is to eat bananas. So I've been eating a banana a day for quite some time now and it seems to be helping. I've also increased how much meat I'm eating, not just protein protein, but actual meat. I've been craving uh, ground beef. And fortunately, the little local store had some very lean ground beef was uh, marked down, and I bought a whole bunch of packages of it. Wee! Whoa! And I'm eating it when I need to eat it, and not apologizing for it. Uh, and it's relatively inexpensive, so I don't have to feel bad or like I'm going to go over my budget. Are we at the end of the world because I'm glitching? Hmm. So I'm learning how to take care of my multiple sclerosis since I can't expect that anybody else will help, you know? I think we're at the end of the world, but... Oh, you know why it doesn't say you're at the end of the world? Because it turned chat off. Hello. So I'm learning how to take care of all this. And on top of that, you know, I got Netflix recently. Because, like, I don't go to movies and... Yike, and I don't buy DVDs or whatever or buy any kind of entertainment online as like um, mp3s or whatever I don't do any of that I I just don't so I got Netflix and a show that was on in well it was right before the Millennium so it was 1999 was the first year because they did an episode about New Year's and the Millennium and whether all the computers are gonna crash and you know that junk and uh, it's called the West Wing it's about the White House, it's about how presidential government works, but not just presidential. The United States government is really interesting. Well, one thing I had forgotten about that show is the character who, the character of the president, the, um, you know, he's a pretend president. He's not really the president. It's a fiction. Whoa, look at that. Um, 
he has multiple sclerosis. It got really scary because uh, near the end of his presidency, he lay down to rest and somebody came in to ask him some questions or something and he was lying on a couch and he said, that's where they they didn't do that part. They changed all this with wool and whatnot. You know, they gave commands and said, turn all this into wool and whatever that white stone is, it's a, it's a diorite. Well, anyway, but they didn't change that over there, so I'm guessing that's a border also. I wish there was one of those hippy hoppy things. Oh, well. So I was really scared because that was, he'd been president for seven years and it was temporary. It came back. Like I said, these weird nerve things that happen, sometimes they come back and sometimes they don't. But he couldn't use his arms and or legs right away. And after a while, he still didn't have any use of his legs and had to go visit Chinese dignitaries in a wheelchair. So it was pretty scary to me to think how quickly and how severely things can go wrong. So I've had to work on a lot of stuff for the last, I don't know, month or so. A lot of stuff. But I'm back now. Partly because I got my new graphics card. I don't have a very la -dee da computer here. But I was using the internal graphics card. I can never remember if it's GPU or CPU. It's a dyslexia thing. I can't I can't remember which is which. But the graphics card that's built in is the one I was using. And I had really bad FPS and like here on this server I was just it was torture. Hunger games and stuff. Well you saw I was getting like nine FPS in that game I played where I came in second. So this is that ballistic bow. I guess this is a beautiful um, squid or octopus or something eating this giant boat but look what's back here I don't know the names of the people who are on Stampy's videos okay but the ink booth welcome to the ink booth but this is the guy he's one of the um, people who plays with Stampy I don't even know Stampy's full name did you know that well, I don't play X... Whoa. Oh, cool! Oh, wow. I wish I had a thing of milk, though. <laughs> it didn't do that last time I was here. Is it going to go away? Thank you. Look at that. So, it's tearing up a ship. Isn't that neat? So, I don't know who all these characters are. So, you're going to have to forgive me. There's another one that I think might... It is there a squishy or a squashy? Don't laugh at me. I don't know what I'm saying. Uh, a squishy or a squashy that might or might not be Stampy's girlfriend, partner, friend, person. Because, and does she have something to do with rubber ducks? Because I've seen her. I've also seen Adam Clark, Wizard Keen from Wonder Quest. He's got a little Easter egg on here. So I'm kind... Whoa! The graphics card helped a lot! Not a fancy one. It's an NVIDIA GeForce... Uh... 320, maybe? But it went from, like, 9 frames per second on Wolfie and Decadence's Realms server to about 50. And I would say that's an improvement. I always had problems here. Oh no. Of course. Oh. Well, you know what I have to say about this. So I'm assuming that probably uh, this is a thing for Tomahawk. Well, you know what I have to say about it. I love you, Neuro, but you know what I have to say about this. <laughs> All right. Uh, I don't see him in here. I mean, Tomahawk. I don't see him, but I assume this is a Tomahawk place. These two are all friends who play on Xbox together, and and you know, Neuro start. Yeah, there he is. What? Who is that? What does it say? It says, "Yeah, you got to risk it for a biscuit." It's that Tom O'Hawk. 
He's never seen a Native American in his life. I bet you anything. Yeah, and look, he's got those <laughs> lines under his eyes like he's playing football. I guess he thinks that's quote unquote war paint. Whatever. Anyway, we'll teach him what Native Americans are, won't we, people? Whoa. So, e so what? So the graphics card is much better, and I love this headset. I love this headset. So now I've made a couple of commitments to some friends of mine to do some collaborations. One of them is going to be a series. One of them is going to be, I don't know, uh, just hanging out thing. Uh, waiting for Minecon to be over because, you know, Neuro and River and everybody I want to be with or hang out with or sit and talk to is either in or near London right now. <laughs> and ain't going to be no going to London for me. Not this year, that's for sure. Whee! Wouldn't it be nice if they had it someplace? <sighs> Bummer. Some place that I could actually get to someday that I wouldn't have to. I think an airplane would cost me about $3,000. And then there's where do I sleep? Because, you know, it's not like I can sleep in my truck. I'd have to rent a hotel room or something. Can I even? I don't think I can. I think I should have aimed better. Oh, this boat's funny. Um, so, oh, there's the duck. You, so you tell me when we get over here whose skin this is, if you're smart. Because, I mean, I can't watch every, all the, every time, all the time YouTubers, right? Not all. I'm going to go see what these are. I think they're mermaids. So, yeah, I saw a tweet today. It was Neuro and River and Adam Clark, Wizard King. And they were at Big Ben which is that big giant clock in London. And I was like, oh. it's not that I'm jealous because they're at Minecon or anything like that. It's just that, okay, one time, not long ago, Adam Clark came to California. But yeah, these are mer people. Like mer people? Yep, pretty sure. Um, and he visited Neuro and River. And I was like, and they're only 1,200 miles away. If my truck ran better and if I had the money for the gas, I would have so gone and crashed that party. I really would have. I just want to hug them. They're really cool people and they've been really generous and friendly and kind to me. And I just would like to hang, you know? So that's the only, if I went to Minecon, that would be what I'd want to do. Hang out with River and Neuro and Adam Clark. And I went over it last night. I was out in the backyard talking to my dogs about it. Who would I like to see at Minecon? And that's what? Dang, blast it. I'm so good at parkour. You see why I didn't do that parkour loop-de-loop -loop thing at the... No. That ain't happening. Uh, how do you do this? I see you think about it too much and then you can't do it at all. Um, uh, well, anyway, up there on the back of the duck... My dog thinks I'm yelling at him. Oh, I'm sorry, Weasel. Oops. On the back, on, up, uh, up there. See that little hole? That's the person's a player head. Oh, wait, maybe, oh, I've, there's a jumpy thing. Okay, 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 okay. <gasps> no! Well, that was bad. Uh, if I just go straight up in the air, it won't let me go straight up in the air. It'll make me go for I don't know. I'm going to try it one more time. One more time. One more. Type. Type. Oh, gosh. Let me go. 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 Bummer. I just want to get on the duck. Can I get on the duck? What if I, instead of aiming up, what if I, <gasps> dang, nabbit. <sighs> well, I guess that's not happening. And I'm scaring the snot out of my animals because I keep yelling. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, there's something up there. There's probably something in that boat, too. You know anybody famous that has something to do with boats? 
Kurt J. Mack, but he wouldn't be here, I don't think, because he doesn't do Xbox 360, right? Okay, aim at the Pope, aim at the Pope. Oh! Oh! I made it. Okay, 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 we're here. See why I wanted to go for a walk here? Isn't this nice? Really? What? What? I was thinking, you know, how they make their... They use emerald blocks for, like, loot chests. I was thinking maybe that was one of those. Beep. 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 Oh, maybe I get to the duck this way. Oh, it didn't work. What do you mean? Oh, gosh. Go, 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 go. Poo. I can't get on that duck. Last night I just jumped up on it, but I can't seem to parkour right now. I seem to have... I never did have parkour skills. I was going to say I seem to have lost my parkour skills, but let's not lie, shall we? I never had any parkour skills. So I got a lot of stuff I want to do, and I'm pretty sure... What do you see what I'm building here on the TEI Creative Server? I'm pretty... It's going to be really nice. It's going to be really big, too. It goes all the way from... I think ground level on the TEI um, Plot Me World is like either 30 or 15. It's really low. And then all the way up to build height. You know me. Build height. I don't think there... There might be some stuff underground. If I can get help, I would like to make a note block thing. I would like it to play a song. But I don't know if I'm going to get any help, you know? So that might be, uh... I can't believe I'm actually... Wow! I just parkoured all the way across on the... Hello? On the leafy doodles. Oh, bugga! Where am I now? Oh, I went into the border. Okay. Alright. Uh, I'm never going to get on that duck. <laughs> the duck eludes me. So, I just thought that I would, um, let you know that things are okay. I've got plans. Oh, my gosh. And I thought it would be nice to do it in a place that was really interesting. And, boy, is this place really interesting. I would love so much to be part of this build, you know? Wow. It took them a long, long time. I'm sure they're really tired, too. A lot of people worked on this, and a lot of people designed stuff for it, too. They have a large build team, and, they're, and they've got some very, very um, precocious and creative people that work with them. So, I mean, some of the best. This is really pro-style art. Look at how that looks with the light-colored stone and then the green. Look at that. Look at that. Isn't it gorgeous? That is so beautifully designed. Isn't that beautiful? Think outside the box. Don't think like everybody else. Think for yourself. Build your own thing. Do your own stuff. And this is a secret tunnely doodle. And I'm out of time. So, I'm going to start at the tunnel. And who knows where we'll go next time. Because you always spawn back where you were, you know, at the at the spawn spawn, I'm not going to spawn back here. So I don't know um, where I'll be when I come back. But for now, I'm right here. So welcome to TEI. I'm getting back to work because I have the equipment, the time, and the motivation and the support to do it. So see you soon. I hug you. But my arms don't bend. Bye. Holy cow, man. I will kill you. Like, dislike, share, comment, subscribe, and let's go get it.